Welcome to an Ashley a day. Hooray! Hey everybody, welcome to an Ashley a day, day 99, which means tomorrow is day 100. Today we are going to talk about my favorite animal because honestly I can't think of anything else to talk about. So, we're going to talk about ducks. I really like ducks. They are so cute. And Courtney keeps posting videos of ducklings on my wall. Like there was one where a guy had a camera and he was running, looked down, like there's like a little yellow duckling running behind him. It was so cute. There's another one I've seen with the mama and a bunch of babies and they're waddling across the sidewalk and all of a sudden they get blown over by wind. And it's so sad, but so cute. They all get back together, but they're like rolling <laughs> along the ground. Oh, it is really cute. There was one time I was driving in the car with my sister Danielle, and we were in like a strip mall kind of thing, and she was driving. And I look out the window, and I go, oh my god, but really loud, and <laughs> it was because there was a mama and a bunch of babies, and she freaked out because, well, I was screaming, and then we took videos of them, and they were so cute, and I just, I want to hold a baby ducky because they're so cute. In my backyard, we have a pond, and in the springtime and throughout the summer we get ducks that like to come and you know visit every year we normally get different ducks I can tell because I like to feed them and so when I go out the next spring and they don't automatically come up to me I know that they're different ducks a couple years you know I've got them very used to me <laughs> sometimes they'll come up to our patio door and sit there quacking in the morning like where's our bread <laughs> and they're so cute one year we had uh, babies well the mom had babies and they were so precious I would videotape them and I'd crumple up bread and leave crumbs for them and they were so cute. And I remember one time we had the dogs out and I am super protective of these ducklings. Like I love my dogs. Chance and Harley were both living with us at the time. And I love, like, like I love my, do my dogs, but I love the ducks even more. And they started to go after the ducks and they got them in their mouth. I literally grabbed them by the collar and like threw them, well not really that bad, but threw them across the yard. Like I pulled them off. And it was so sad, but I mean, nobody died, thankfully. All the ducklings survived. They all kind of waddled and hid. We didn't see them too much longer after that, probably because the mom figured it probably wasn't the best place for her ducklings with two dogs running around. But I saved all the ducklings, so that was good. I don't know why ducks are my favorite animal. Probably just because they're so cute, and I seriously want one as a pet. I almost want to just, like, go up to a nest of duck eggs and wait there so they can break and see that I'm their mom. But no, that'd be so mean. I would only do that, I would only take in ducklings that way if I knew the mom was, you know, dead or something. I would never take ducklings away from their mom. Just cause, I mean, I'm sure I can't take care of them as well as she could. I would be willing to adopt ducklings though that have lost their mothers. <laughs> Like, cause that'd be awesome and they could swim in my bathtub and they would be so cute. Oh, I love ducklings. I saw this really sad set of pictures where it was mama and a bunch of babies, sewage grate, mama and like two babies. Apparently when they walked over it, they all fell through and Christina showed me this and I was like, oh my god, like, what happened to them? Apparently they were rescued, so everything is good. Everything's a-okay. But yeah, ducks are my favorite animal. Like, I've showed you my duckies on the wall, and I don't know if I ever showed you all my rubber duckies, but my dad has been getting me rubber duckies for every holiday, so when that holiday comes up, I put them out. So, yeah, they're so cute. I love ducks. I will see you tomorrow on day 100. I really can't think of anything spectacular to do. My last attempt at a milestone video kind of failed a little bit. I don't remember if you remember that, but it did. So, yeah. But I will see you tomorrow on day 100, and until then, goodbye!